She is on tonight for donors who can help save the life of a young Rhode Island boy. We first told you last week about six-year-old Tyler Seddon's latest battle with cancer. Now local firefighters are holding a blood drive and bone marrow registration to help Tyler with his fight. Iowa News reporter Todd Wallace joins us now from Boroughville with live coverage. And Mike, the blood drive and bone marrow registration got underway at 2.30 here at the Pasco Fire Department. Let's take a look at some of the video we shot really not too long ago. And you can see that the turnout so far has been very impressive. In fact, about 40 people have come to see whether they are a bone marrow match for six-year-old Tyler Seddon of Burrowville. Tyler fought leukemia from 2010 until 2012. He was cancer-free. Then the disease came back last November, so his next step is to get a bone marrow transplant. But first, of course, he needs to find a match. During his treatment, Tyler has used over 200 units of blood products and will continue to need more transfusions. This blood drive is actually a 20-year annual event, but this turnout so far is especially for Tyler and his brave fight and battle against leukemia. Coming up new at 6 o'clock, we talk to Tyler's mother, Rachel. We'll find out how Tyler is doing and also how she's doing and what her response is for this great turnout for her young son and his brave fight. For now, reporting live from the Northwest Mobile Newsroom, Todd Wallace, Eyewitness News.